हाय ऑल एज ऑल ऑफ यू नो दैट रिसेंटली टी कंडक्टेड डी जावा एग्जाम टू अपग्रेड निंजा प्रोफाइल्स टू डिजिटल ऑन 14 जून 2022. ट्वेंटी सो गाइज इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस द डी सी ए जावा एग्जाम एक्सपीरियंस एंड मेनी मोर थिंग्स दिस वीडियो इज फॉर बोथ फ्रेशर्स एंड दोज हु हैव ऑलरेडी गिवन द एग्जाम फॉर दोज हु हैव ऑलरेडी गिवन द एग्जाम वी विल डिस्कस वट शुड यू डू फॉर द नेक्स्ट साइकिल वट शुड यू लर्न फ्रॉम दिस साइकिल we will try to find in which area you should focus more and also we will try to find which type of code you should practice more and for freshers we will discuss the pattern and the level of difficulty so that they can prepare accordingly i will try to compile all the mcqs at one place and also i will try to provide the solution for the code that they have asked in the upcoming weekends okay so guys let's start the video before starting the video guys please subscribe the channel and like this video first let's talk about the experienced people who have given exam recently so guys as all of you know that there were 27 mcqs and one code correct okay. if you try to look at the mcqs more deeply then you can find that among 27 20 questions you can do it easily i mean they were very easy 5 to 7 questions were difficult to do 27 mcq and one code that was unexpected in one hour so i just request tcs people that please give at least one and half hour to do the codes If you look at this question you can find that they are saying to print all the elements in the array nothing else 12 28 56 33 46 12 28 56 4, 33 46 mm-hmm. so if you look at the option you can find that option A is correct all the options are wrong because if you look at the third one they are simply printing i but we are required to print the array elements so you, they should have written here like a of i then this will be correct If you look at the second question then you can find that they are taking arcs dot length in a and then dividing b by a so if you are not passing anything in arcs as you can see here then it will take zero in a and 10 by 0 is infinity so there were some questions from a spring boot and that was also easy you can see here they are trying to say how can the course configuration be enabled for controller so even if you do not know this if you google out then you can easily find that cross origin is used for course configuration in spring boot okay now guys let's talk about the code so if you look at the code there was only one code okay so the code was difficult because nobody was prepared for the code everybody was thinking that only mcq will come tcs also said that only mcq will come but they gave a bouncer and gave one code so that's why nobody was mentally prepared to do the coding so that's why almost 95 to 98% in gdc java nobody did the code so guys one more thing was that they have given only one hour so it is very difficult for anybody so the lesson that we can learn from this dc java exam is that they might ask same code pattern in next exam also like they used to ask in ira like in every ira they used to ask same question based on same logic only names uh, values like that they change and the logic will be same so i think in the upcoming dc exams they might ask the same code pattern okay